start. <laughs> yeah, well, we did much better last week, uh, much better than last week with, ten, with uh, 10 men this time. We, we got a lot of practice last week. We had 65 minutes or 70 minutes playing last week with, uh, with only 10 men. So we got things a little bit better organized more quickly this time. Um, I think we know when we come down here to Tamisari, even though it's a nice town, it's not a nice town to play because, you know, you see how the team plays, you know. And uh, they, they make it very, very difficult for you, you know. They play to their strengths. They, um, they get the ball moving sometimes pretty well. So I think we can be really happy with the point, especially that we had 10 men for the period that we had the 10 men this time. We had to work very hard again. So we got, we got something from it this time. So that was a good thing. Gabriel, 0-0, one, one more in the field. Tell us about the game. Uh, the first half we had uh, some difficulties to, to, to progress with the ball, to keep, to, to find the, the spaces to, to get a good chances. Uh, the second half, I think we, we start better, we, we change something. I think we, the, the team was, was doing uh, okay. Uh, we get the, the, this goal on outside uh, and after that with the red card we try to move we try to shake we, with some changes also to but on the last moment on the last chances uh, we didn't get the, the clear action the, the clean uh, last action to, to find the, the way to, to score and <coughs> of course uh, it's zero zero against really good team but uh, you have this smell that today you lost two points, but of course, after two weeks, maybe we will think already that we win one. Thanks. John, you're back or do you have to run? What about the Yeah, I don't know. How is this from? We're going to come out and play and play the And we wish before that it will be a tough match. So, but how is it going to be a red card? So, it's over now. It's a red point. Johan. Vad ska vi göra för att få det målet? Ja, du. Idag var det nog... Vad heter det? Helt okej. Okay. Första halvlek vi skapade som sagt inte så mycket. Rulla boll allt för sakta. Och vi hade lite problem med deras långa uppspel. Och sen kom vi ut ganska bra i andra. Och röra, röra korten så tycker jag att vi spelar sämre efter det. Och de spelar kompakt och, och vad heter det? Dro ner packan och vi hade ett kvaliteten offensivt och inte heller tempo, bolltempo ordentligt för att, för att flytta dem ordentligt och hitta ytan och mellan dem. Och, och nu spelar vi bara utanför dem hela matchen och gjorde det egentligen ganska enkelt för dem att hålla nollan. Att, att, måste ju vara lite besvikna med det här. Men det, det är inte alltid så lätt att bli hemma med och som sagt att matchbilden ändrar helt. Och, och vad heter den här gången så blir det, det så här. Men fyra poäng på två matcher så vi får vara nöjda med bästa starten vi har hittills. Tack så mycket. Uh, Kike, uh, Popovic, do you know anything about his injury? I think he twisted his ankle. I think, and the player went right through. The, the, I think his studs were on the ground, and you know these fields. They, mm. if you get your studs stuck in the astroturf field, yeah. there's only one thing that happens: the yeah. joint twists. So I think, I think that's the main problem. Yeah. Uh, just got all of playing mm -hmm. time. What do you think about him? Well, that's a really good question. He's got, he has got a lot of playing time, actually. It's a big surprise, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's done well. He had, an in, he had an ankle injury in the winter time as well. Um, I don't know how often you guys trained in BK46, you know, but it's usually a big change when you go from a lower level to a higher level. And um, it's just a fact these types of fields, AstroTurf fields, aren't good for tall players. You know, and you're, between your joints, you have longer distances, You things happen. And John had a a couple of injuries, in the, probably from the training, training so much and training on astroturf. But uh, he's done really well. He's got a, you know, he's been doing well for us. He'll get better and better, you know. So when, I don't know when we come the next time, <laughs> but you might not recognise him the next time. He'll be, an, he'll be an even better player when we come the next time. Uh, Gabriel, uh, next game, he go away. Um, Olila, Sake, what do you know? What do you know about them? Uh, all it has just was a virus, a sickness, and I think we'll be okay. Uh, Zake, I think uh, we, I, I ho I, we hope 
can be as soon as possible, but we don't think that will be okay yet. What do you think about Nico game? First away game? Yeah, it's first away <coughs> game. Also, he's one of the, that on the paper, uh, one of the top teams. Uh, now we will focus for this game. Uh, we didn't have uh, time to, to focus for this game yet. And of course, it uh, will be harder for us because we now we are doing home games for two months. So now we have to adapt again to, to play away. and. But for sure, I think the, the team will be harder as we are here and as we, we was on the, on the cup uh, against TPS, against Maria Ham. I think the, the team, in, the, in these hard games, usually we, we are doing our best and I hope we will be like this. Thank you. Uh, No, no, delvis kanske med matchbilder ändrar ju helt och hållet också att Haka drog ju ner hela packan och spelat vad heter det med hela, hela laget under boll hela tiden precis som helt rätt beslut av dem såklart men att det var en liten ny situation för oss också att vi på länge spelat med Emma. vi har inte gjort det ännu med under Gabriel så det är ju alltid en omställning och, och så så tyvärr så lyckades vi inte idag vi får jobba på det under träningsveckor Yeah. I was right next to it. <laughs> Pretty good view. I don't know. I saw the fullback sort of pushing into our players. He did that, and our players sort of pushed him back, and he went down. That was it.